Hey Facebook, how's it going? How are you guys doing? If this is your first time checking out Chula Divine's channel, what is up? I'm Amy. If you're returning, welcome. Sorry, I'm just finishing sucking on a haul because I'm mean, gonna stop coughing. All right. Lovely reading for you guys today. Very beautiful reading. I am so excited to share this message with you guys. So this is your message for April 19th, which is a Friday. We made it. So let's start off with your Oracle cards. Two came out for you guys today. First one says, trust. I accept that my inner voice will always guide me correctly. There you guys go. Trust. Whatever you guys got going on in your life right now, the good, the bad, the mixed up, the chaos, it's all happening for a reason. Trust in spirit, trust in God, trust in where you're going, all right? An honesty was the second card. I can't always expect the truth from others, but I can expect it for myself. I really like that. I really think it's beautiful. I really think that all, in all honesty, everything comes and starts with you. You allow someone to treat you as you want to be treated. And I feel like you need to be honest with yourself today and ask yourself, are you doing what you need to do? And are you going where you need to go? And is it in the right direction for you? Are you the person that you want to be? It's about being honest with yourself um, and kind of like where your direction of your life is going. Um, if you're not happy, it's time to change, guys. It's time to stop living in the past and start living for the future. Start creating the future that you want. All right? Things are unfolding for you guys. It's a beautiful reading. Um, things are happening really quick, and they will be happening really quick, especially coming into the weekend. I really get a sense of that. I really get a sense of you. Some type of, like, really fast message is going to come through for somebody. Um, this is a time, you know what, dream big, babe, like go out there and go after what you want. Doesn't matter how old you are. Doesn't matter what your past was. Doesn't matter how many kids you have. If you have a dream in mind, you need to go for it. Especially today. That's the message that I'm getting. You know, go, go hard for it. Go, go get it. Whatever it is that you guys have been manifesting, whatever it is that you guys have been creating, I feel like spirit saying, you know what, this is your chance to go get it. Dreams equal reality. Make it happen. All right. Three of air. A lot of us, when we enter into a breakup or when we break up with someone or someone breaks up with us, we instantly go into this mode of what's wrong with me? You know, how come everyone else around me is in a relationship and I'm single, right? And then you start thinking to yourself, am I, is there something wrong with me? Am I unlovable? Am I unworthy? You know, am I just too hard to love? Spirit's saying no. Spirit's saying the reason that I have removed this person from your life is because they cannot go where I am taking you. They will only hinder you in your next phrase. Remember that when spirit removes someone from your life, that is his protection towards you or her protection. You need to hold on and remember that better things are coming. For whoever is going through a recent breakup or just, you know, maybe you've been single for a while and you're just feeling like love is not in your cards. Spirit's saying it is in your cards, but you got to believe that you're worthy of it. You got to believe that you are worthy of love, that you are valued, that you, you know, you don't want to go into another relationship taking your issues from your past. Um, so love yourself. Enjoy the singlehood because just because you're single doesn't mean there's something wrong with you. You can create the future that you guys want. You can reach out and go for what you want right now. Four of water. See how she's reaching out? You can reach out. <coughs> you can, oh, sorry, guys. You can say to yourself, you know what? That relationship, it didn't work out. But that's because... I I needed more. 
That's because I wanted more. And spirit knew that. And spirit took this person out of my life. It's hard, guys. Breakups are hard. And I don't know who needs to hear this, but you will get through this. You will start to surround yourself with people who value you, people who see your worth. That is such a high... Well, not a high, but it's it's such a profound message right now about loving who you are being single. Because if you do not know who you are when you're single, then how the heck are you going to know who you are when you're in a relationship? You know, don't end one relationship and jump into another. That's often what causes a lot of current relationships to fail because you don't take that time to heal. I feel like you need to heal right now for some of you. But during this healing process, during this time of finding out who you are, you know, it's funny because when you first meet someone and they ask you, well, tell me about yourself. Well, what are you going to say? You know, if you don't take that time to find out who you are, if you don't take that time to find out who you are being single, then how do you, how do you find out who you are when you're in a relationship? You know, you need to absorb this energy. You need to put this energy into you. You know, it's so someone hurt you. Forgive them, wish them well, and send them on their way. Right? I know it kind of seems cold, but it's like, you can sit there. I can't tell you to move on. You can stay stuck. You can stay unhappy. Or you can move forward. Go after this new love that wants to come through for some of you. Someone is coming into your life. Two of water is here. So this is that divine love. There is someone coming towards someone. This is that spirit's bringing you this person because this person's going to bring out the best of you, not the worst of you. So stay grounded. Trust. Be honest with yourself and be honest with other people. <coughs> if, you're, if you're wanting a committed relationship, make that up front. If you're wanting just to be fuck buddies... Make that up front. All right? What are your goals? Because this is this is that period of finding out what your wants and your needs are and, and really holding that down. You know, if someone doesn't love you for you, then why, why put all your energy into that? You're only going to be left heartbroken. You know, stay true to who you are. <coughs> right? Because what you have coming to you, star card, pouring abundance, but you have to walk away. Walk away from what's not keeping you fulfilled. Walk away from what is keeping you in stagnation mode. Have hope. Because the world card, completion, endings, new cycles, new beginnings. But you got to have trust. You have to have faith. You have to know what you bring to the table. You have to know your worth. So important, guys. All right. Oracle card. Postcard from Spirit says this. Dear Stu, even though life seems now to be moving full steam ahead, it's a time to rest. Allow ideas to flow through you and take root in your heart before they reach your mind. Honor this process by becoming empty to allow for inspiration and the magic of dreaming. You might feel lazy or unproductive, but we know better. Just as sleep is a way to recharge before renewal, so are you in a time for dreaming. In this powerful process of co-creation, your soul merges with spirit in a profound way so you can receive your music directly from source and play your part in the sympathy of life. You are being invited to bear witness to the great creation and tune into what spirit or what others can't hear. We have so many dreams to share with you in the scared and in the visible. Don't worry. We will wake you when the time is returned with a new dream. No need to set an alarm clock. Loving you always. All right, guys. So that is your message for Friday, April 19th. I hope you guys have a fantastic day. I hope that this message resonates. Um, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Let me know. Know that I'm sending you guys all love and light, and I will see you guys again for Saturday. Take care, guys.